The best minds are not in government. If any were, business would hire them away. Reagan believed that the private sector generally attracts the most talented individuals due to its competitive nature and potential for greater rewards. He expressed skepticism about the government's ability to attract and retain the best minds and implied that business and entrepreneurship offer more effective solutions. Government exists to protect us from each other. Where government has gone beyond its limits is in deciding to protect us from ourselves. Reagan advocated for limited government intervention and warned against excessive regulation. He believed that the primary role of government is to ensure the safety and rights of its citizens, not to dictate personal choices or protect individuals from the consequences of their own actions. The greatest leader is not necessarily the one who does the greatest things. He is the one that gets the people to do the greatest things. Reagan emphasized the importance of leadership and the ability to inspire and motivate others. He believed that true leadership is not about personal achievements, but rather about empowering and mobilizing people to achieve greatness collectively. Status quo, you know, is Latin for the mess we're in. Reagan used humor to criticize the status quo and bureaucratic inefficiency by highlighting the literal translation of status quo, he suggested that the current state of affairs often needs improvement and called for bold action and reforms to address existing problems. Peace is not absence of conflict. It is the ability to handle conflict by peaceful means. Reagan defined peace as more than just the absence of war. He emphasized the importance of diplomacy, negotiation, and peaceful resolution of conflicts. This quote reflects his commitment to diplomacy and his belief in finding peaceful solutions through dialogue. The trouble with our liberal friends is not that they're ignorant. It's just that they know so much that isn't so Reagan used humor to critique his liberal opponents and challenge their beliefs. He suggested that their knowledge might be based on misconceptions or incorrect information, implying that conservative principles and policies offer more accurate understanding of the world. Entrepreneurs and their small enterprises are responsible for almost all the economic growth in the United States. Reagan acknowledged the crucial role of entrepreneurs and small businesses in driving economic growth. He believed that free market capitalism and entrepreneurship are the engines of prosperity, generating innovation, job creation, and overall economic advancements. A man is not free unless government is limited. This quote encapsulates Reagan's belief in limited government and individual freedom. He argued that excessive government intervention can restrict personal liberties and impede individual potential. Reagan believed that freedom thrives when government power is restrained and individuals have the space to pursue their own goals. The most terrifying words in the English language are, I'm from the government and I'm here to help. Reagan expressed skepticism about government assistance and the potential for unintended consequences. He highlighted the potential dangers of excessive bureaucracy and government intervention, suggesting that such promises of help can lead to inefficiency. Government's first duty is to protect the people, not run their lives. Reagan emphasized the primary role of government in ensuring the safety and security of its citizens. He believed that government should focus on protecting individual rights and liberties rather than micromanaging or controlling people's lives. There are no easy answers, but there are simple answers. We must have the courage to do what we know is morally right. Reagan acknowledged that complex problems often lack simple or quick solutions. However, he stressed the importance of moral courage and standing up for what is right even when the path ahead is challenging. This quote reflects his belief in the need for principled leadership. Freedom is never more than one generation away from extinction. We didn't pass it on to our children in the bloodstream. It must be fought for, protected, and handed on for them to do the same. Reagan underscored the importance of actively preserving and defending freedom. He believed that freedom is not automatically guaranteed, but rather requires continuous effort and vigilance. This quote serves as a call to action, urging individuals to protect and pass on the values of freedom to future generations. Government's view of the economy could be summed up in a few short phrases. If it moves, tax it. If it keeps moving, regulate it. And if it stops moving, subsidize it. 
Reagan employed humor to criticize government intervention in the economy. He satirically portrayed the tendency of governments to tax, regulate, and subsidize various aspects of the economy, suggesting that such actions can stifle growth and innovation. The future doesn't belong to the faint-hearted. It belongs to the brave. Reagan encouraged resilience and boldness in the face of challenges. He believed that those who are willing to take risks and confront difficulties are the ones who will shape this quote embodies Reagan's optimism and his belief in the power of determination and courage. We can't help everyone, but everyone can help someone. Reagan emphasized the importance of individual responsibility and compassion. He acknowledged that it may not be possible to help every person in need, but he encouraged individuals to make a positive difference in someone's life, emphasizing the significance of personal acts of kindness and support. These quotes provide insights into Ronald Reagan's conservative principles, including limited government, individual freedom, entrepreneurship, moral courage, and the importance of personal responsibility.